Now, are your students focused or are distractions getting worse in your classroom? Now, there's something really important to consider with work in memory that attention is context specific and attention is the key to learning. Without being attentive in the moment, it's very hard to process information. So in today's classrooms, uh, they are full of distractions. Now in this research, the Hervet method, H stands for hydration, E equal equilibrium, R respiration, V for vision, A for audition, and T for touch helps reset, focus, and boost engagement. So the Hervet method, there's another acronym for you. I've written it here, and I've given you some examples in PE and mathematics. Neuroscience shows that short targeted activities improve memory and attention, helping boost readiness to learn. So for example, at the start of the lesson, get students to stand up, stretch, those kind of things. Starting lessons with a focus helps boost techniques that align with how our brain works, how it processes information. And this can ensure that your students are primed for success, ready to engage with difficult material. So you've got a maths example and a physical education example uh, from me. Try it tomorrow, start your next lesson with a one minute stretch, a one minute breathing activity, and people that are participating in my guide to memory research will know that I'm a big fan of short brain breaks, which are curriculum focused. See the difference for yourself and discover more in this research paper here, um, and let me know how you get on. Thanks for watching.